to program your Across International tube or chamber furnace temperature, first connect to the power supply and switch the furnace on. This will begin our Eurotherm temperature controllers. Our Eurotherm temperature controllers will start displaying ambient room temperature, what is read by the thermocouples. Then, in order to set our program, we will press the cycle button. This is the working operating parameter that's set by the program, so we will leave this alone and press cycle again. This is where we select which program we are going to edit. Let's edit the first program and press the cycle button again. This will select the unit of time in which we are going to program our ramp rate or our heating rate to our target temperature. You may select between hours, seconds, and minutes. We're going to select minutes and press the cycle button again. Then we will select the unit of time for our dwell cycle or the time that our furnace will stay at target temperature. We may again cycle between minutes or hours, but we will select minutes and press the cycle button. This is the heating rate or ramp rate of our furnace. So this is currently set to 10 degrees Celsius per minute. We may program our 1200 Celsius furnaces up to 30 degrees Celsius per minute and our 14 to 1800 degrees Celsius up to 10 degrees per minute, reaching 1200 Celsius. And then above 1200 Celsius, we reduce our recommended ramp rate to five degrees Celsius per minute. Right now, we will set 10 degrees Celsius per minute and press the cycle button. This is our first selected temperature set point for the Eurotherm controller program. It is currently set to 300 Celsius. Press the cycle button to accept. This is to indicate that our ramp is on. You may also turn the ramp off. Press the cycle button again and you may set the time at which your furnace will maintain temperature during the first dwell cycle. We will leave this at five minutes. Press the cycle button. This is to turn our dwell cycle on. If we did not want to maintain temperature for the set amount of time during the dwell cycle, we can turn this off. Press the cycle button again to accept. And now we will set our second ramp. Again, we may set it to 10 degrees Celsius per minute. Our second temperature set point, we have set to 900 Celsius. Again, we may accept. The ramping cycle is on and so on. To accept your program, press the leftmost button and then to power on the furnace and run your temperature cycle, you are going to want to press the up and down button at the same time. See how it is turned on the run button? Don't worry, you may play with your temperature controllers and their parameters until initiating the furnace and then it will only begin heating once you press the on button. As you can see, our amperage has gone up and our volts and amperage meters are showing the furnace is powered on and you are be ready to begin your heat treatment cycle with your Across International tube or chamber furnace. Turn off in order to end the cycle. And don't forget to switch your furnace off.